Like other sciences, statistical sciences also have its own terminology. Though there are many terms used in statistics that we commonly use in our daily life language, but they do have a little different meaning than our layman language. In this module, we will discuss those terminologies. The first term is population. Average person thinks of population as the human beings. But when we talk about population in statistics, it talks about totality of aggregate of anything that is of our interest. That may include humans, that may include cells, and even the lab equipment can be our population. So it's in population, our major focus is on our interest. Anything that relates to our interest of our study is called a part of our population. So let's take an example from the province of Punjab. If we are interested in knowing the weights of all the children enrolled in elementary schools of the Bahawalpur district, then the population will be all the children enrolled in the elementary school of the Bahawalpur district. You may not consider the students of elementary school studying in Rajanpur, studying in Rahim Yar Khan, Bahawal Nagar, or other neighboring districts. Since our focus is only on the Bahawalpur district, all the elementary school students in the Bahawalpur district are going to be the part of our population. There are different types of population. Finite population is one of them. When all the population units are countable, we call such populations as finite population. Like number of cancer patients in the city of Lahore. We can count them. We can identify them. Then it will be called a finite population. The other type of population is infinite population. And from word, it's very clear that this is the type of population when all the units in the population are not countable. We can think of it as the number of cancer tumors or cancer cells in a human body. We may not be able to count them exactly. Such populations are called infinite populations. Populations are further divided into different other types. The first one is the target population. It is the general population that study seeks to understand. The second is source population, which is the specific individuals from which a representative sample will be drawn. And then there is a sample population. It's all the individuals which are asked to participate in a study. And the last one is a study population, which are the eligible participants. Let's take an example that if we want to study breast cancer patients in Pakistan, all the breast cancer patients in Pakistan will be our target population. But if we want to collect the data only from Lahore, then our source population will be all the breast cancer patients living in the city of Lahore. The sample population could be all the patients who are visiting either in Mole or Shokathanam Hospital. Out of them, not all the patients with cancer are going to be eligible to be the part of the study. Therefore, we'll set some eligibility criteria. And for those who are eligible to be a part of our study are actually going to be called as our study population. Whenever we study the whole population, we call it census. And in our native language, we call it Mardam Shumari. Census is a survey conducted on all the population where we study each and every single individual which is a part of our population. That's why it's defined as the complete enumeration of population at a point in time with respect to well-defined characteristics. 
any value that originates as a result of, of the studying of a population is called a population parameter. These are the outcomes of the senses. Population parameters are known as the true value, which do not change. Population parameters are constant. Population parameters are defined by Greek letters. Like if we talk about the population mean, then the Greek letter that used to represent population mean is called mu. If you if you if, if you want to study the population proportion, then the Greek letter that defines population proportion is pi. And in similar way, we use a lot of Greek letters for different terminologies used in statistical methods. <laughs>